We are looking at the observatory, the Richmond Hill David Dunlop Observatory, um, constructed in 1935, and within this uh, building is a 74-inch telescope. So up a lot of stairs, but it's worth it in the end. That's pretty impressive once you're up close to it. Yes, it, it is very impressive, and uh, that's one of the reasons this, this dome is one of the reasons why this site is so unique. So tell me about this roof. The, the roof itself, the dome, is kind of interesting to enable us to be able to kind of stargaze anywhere. Yes, uh, so normally it's closed, and you can see it's been opened, and then the telescope can be maneuvered around. The dome also rotates so that uh, whoever is operating the telescope um, can search the skies at their will. But this uniqueness and history was almost lost a few years ago before the town of Richmond Hill stepped in to save the observatory. The property was sold from University of Toronto in 2007 due to some concern from the community about what was going to happen with this very unique facility and the land it was on. Richmond Hill designated this site as a, as a heritage site to protect it and ownership of um, this building and the administration building and approximately 100 acres around it was transferred to Richmond Hill in 2017. The town will now continue to run programs for the public so that everyone can enjoy the history and technology offered by this observation centre. And over to my left we have the administration building. This site was purchased by a woman by the name of Jessie Donalda Dunlop and was donated to the University of Toronto in the 1930s. They identified this site um, as a, a great site for them to do some astronomical research. Uh, this building and the observatory were the construction completed in 1935. So it's a very old building, a site with a lot of uh, natural and cultural heritage. Well, there's a full list of programming happening here through the summer and fall. To find out how you can register, you can go to our website, citynews.ca slash extras. In Richmond Hill, Audra Brown, City News.